hi everyone i hope that you all are doing fine and keeping safe wherever you are i'm doing fantastic i thank god and i can't really complain so first thank you so much for 1400 subscribers like i don't know but this just um it means a lot to me so thank you so much guys i hope we continue to grow each and every single day so on today's episode i have um something new that i'm bringing so i'm bringing my weight loss series like my weight loss journey series and first we are starting with how i gained the weight you know you can't start doing something unless you know I don't know today i did a video of me doing my own makeup and uh, i don't know how it went so uh i'll i'll post it here and now from there onwards you're going to see new series of my weight loss journey and weight loss journey is starting by my uh how i gained the weight so without a lot of stories without getting into a lot of details let me start how i gained the weight so i don't remember being in my ideal weight for the longest time i remember 2020 came and i was like oh i really need to change i really need to do a lot of things if you really know what i mean by wanting to change um this is really your video so in 2021 when 2021 came i was like you know what i really have to do a lot of things i need you want to change i need one I, I want to change my diet i want to change I keep on procrastinating and I keep on saying so guys here is how I gained my weight I don't remember being in my ideal weight even in camp in in high school uh, that sometimes I used to struggle with um with uh, what to what to eat but now here is how I gained my weight back uh, in the day so in 2018 when I was joining campus when i was joining campus yeah i joined campus i was 18 years old and i was i think um 60 63 kgs 63 so coming from the village and uh getting into the campus now like getting into campus my dad paid for me enhanced meal you know enhanced meal and enhanced meal used to be 330 kenya shillings per day to mean breakfast was 110 lunch was 110 dinner was 110 so when i went to campus now breakfast would be let's say for 110 now it's an enhanced meal you could take egg uh, toasted bread with milk tea and sausages for dinner for lunch one would take chicken a piece of chicken chapati or chips uh, with soda or um, rice with meat so that one was the meal for the enhanced then dinner one would also take fish or chapati or uh, meat or whatever so for me having been paid for this enhanced meal i remember every morning i'd go to i'd go to the to the cafeteria and i take um breakfast maybe i used to love sausages kebab tea then for lunch i'd take yogurt and maybe just keep it then during dinner now i'd go for chipo and chicken chipo and so on so when the first semester ended i really found myself like the clothes i went with couldn't couldn't fit me you know that so when i went for the second semester now uh, 1.2 my dad also paid for the enhanced meal so eating enhanced meal it was the same food like the junk it was the chicken the chips the yogurt and so on so uh, at the end of the year i found myself at around 80 80 something kgs from 60 something so i was like oh my goodness what do i do then when i went back home my mom was like oh you're just looking nice oh you've gotten your dad's body you know like my dad also had a, a big body so they're like oh this is now your actual body look at your sister she's also having a big body you know so these people made me believe like it was okay to be that way like they really made me believe it was so okay like okay yeah 
so 2019 i started dating and it did not go as um i planned like you know like i had the weight of that that i had reached like eight or something now then um i started dating and when i started dating again you know for me i i, I didn't see it as a big deal having that campus body now the this the flat tummy and so on and my boyfriend didn't have a problem with the body that i had so that really gave me a lot of comfort and i was like yeah i think i look good maybe the way they used to tell me oh you look good blah a lot you know so i just got so comfortable in the space that i was in so when 2020 came um we broke up so after the breakup i was like you know what i really need to look good you know that revenge by after breakup you want to revenge and not start looking good and a lot of things so yeah i was in that position so now i wanted to look good do you know what i did i was at home i started doing one meal a day so i did one meal a day for like a month and i remember there was this time i lost five kgs it was not in a month it was maybe mid-month i had lost like five kgs then i went to the gym so going back to the gym i was like um i I need to start eating nicely clean so that um, I, I I don't get the weight now so going to the gym I would fast the whole day and now when I'm about to go to the gym I start eating to get the energy but I found myself I would really overeat then I go to the gym or if I go to the gym hungry I'd really lose the morale and the cycle of doing the workout then after leaving the gym I'm like oh let me just eat again I'm going to I'm going to work out you know like have you guys been slaves to your own selves like slaves to your own bodies have you guys been that level oh you've been to that level yeah that is the level i really was in like my body was just controlling me to do this do that eat this don't do that it is so hard and a disclaimer if you see somebody so thin please don't start pulling them and it is a sickness and if you see somebody so so chubby or fat or whatever you call it please don't bully these people it is none of your business stay out of it stay out of it please so i really it was a struggle so i went to the gym for one month and i would see like my time is now starting to get fine and so on but no consistency i was not consistent and i left the gym so the devil now came i do know like the devil can just wait for you in your peace where you are at peace then they just appear yes the devil appeared for me and there is this thing called water fasting and because I wanted to lose weight faster and to look so good, I told myself, girl, this is your, this is your secret. Do this, start water fasting. So the next week, I got into the water fasting. In the morning, I would drink lemon water. During the lunchtime, I drink water only. At night, I would only drink water. The first two days were so hard. The third day, the sleep started going away. Now, the fourth day, uh, I was dizzy. I wanted to fall. And now, the fifth day, I started feeling so good. But now, I was so weak. My stomach was hurting. I was trembling. I couldn't concentrate. Everything was just smelling food. And I was like, why am I a slave to myself? So, when I went to measure my weight, I felt like I reduced with, I think three kgs one week i lost three kgs and I, I was now at 70 something then i told myself i'm going to start fasting again tomorrow so from that point i started eating junk you eat junk with a notion that you're starting fasting tomorrow so when tomorrow comes you you do again then you're like i'm going to fast for 30 days i'm going to fast for one week i'm going to fast then i look at those fasting videos how people are losing weight how it is going so well for them how it's happening miraculously so i'm like you know what me i'm going to do water fasting so i used to overeat 
it is not like you don't get full like literally you don't get full you eat little after 10 minutes you're hungry after 20 minutes you're hungry even after the warming and so on so i went with this trend in 2021 now i remember fasting i think four times i fast i eat again i gain weight back the weight and so on and now it's like it was not working so little did i know i was at 90 something kgs yeah so i've stayed with that that weight for the longest time possible like for the longest time possible and now i've told myself you know what girl i am an achiever i do a lot of things i know i can do this my body is not my own like no let me tell you something you know even today i was outside and people are telling me oh you're looking good oh you're looking good you're looking good but i'm like you don't know I, I, I just want to have a new body all of a sudden not all of a sudden like i just want to have a new body i just want to do a lot of things like i know the people are telling me oh you're looking good even strangers i've met a stranger along the way and she was telling me i think she was going i don't know to the market and she was telling me oh you're looking nice and i'm like oh my goodness i get such compliments but now what i feel from the inside is not um the same thing i've really struggled but i realized like i'm not consistent i do it for like a month then i leave it or i do it for like um three weeks then i leave it you know so i've been thinking about it when the year started i, I really prayed to god i told god god please i don't know i know this is not my portion i know this is not going to be me in this new year please help me so i've come up with a new resolution I, I have come up with a plan i've measured my body i've measured my weight i've measured every part of my body and now when you look at my age and my weight it's putting me to a 28 29 there and you know i'm just 23 i'm turning 24 this month i know in may this year so i really got um discouraged mentally but not physically I, I i felt so bad about it when now the bmi was killing me and so on so i prayed to god and i, I i've i've really been crying and i'm going the reason as to why i'm posting this i just want to let anybody out there who has been trying to gain weight or who has been trying to lose weight that it is possible and i am going to show you guys that it is really possible i've been thinking about this thing i've been meditating about it and i've said it is time to go and now what did i eat to make me gain the weight if you want to gain weight if you want to gain weight the correct way or the bad way number one carbohydrates i used to eat i'm so addicted addicted to carbohydrates the chapatis the mandazis the i don't know everything carbohydrate name it so carbohydrates number two milk like i drink yogurt a lot of it a lot of the yogurt number three fries i eat french fries like i don't know i, I usually eat them when i get the chance to eat them Br drinks ready-made drinks readily manufactured drinks like soda like the juices those are my diets literally those are my diets those have been my diet so if you want to gain weight on the bad ways i don't know if it is the healthy way of gaining weight or no but those are the things i used to eat and those are the things that have made me to gain weight just eat to those processed food the carbohydrates a lot of it not a lot of it even if it's small small but in big portions you will you will get to get to that body that you want and now i've made resolutions to myself number one i'm not fasting anymore i'm not going to fast because if you fast today the following day you are like let me eat i'm going to fast it doesn't work or maybe you can interfere with your body organs if you're fasting i don't know fasting is really good it's powerful i'll be fasting maybe once in a in a week i want to do 
maybe intermittent fasting where i eat for some certain times and not eat some certain times and yeah that is what i'll go but i'm not going to do water fasting if i am to do water fasting i will do it during the weekends so number one i'm not going to do the full fasting that i used to do i'm going to do either intermittent fasting or water fasting once in a while for a few times number two i've enrolled for the gym and going to the gym it is so hard but it really requires consistency like consistency i know i'm going to do it i'm going to pray and i will try my best to be consistent with the gym number three i have a meal plan that is already set that is what i'm basically going to follow and from today my people we are going to see how it goes at the end of it all i'm going to post all my videos the progress the workout me at the gym me the kind of food i'm starting to eat and so on so that we see how this goes so i think i've gone to the i've gone to the to the dock and they've weighed me and now my hips i think i think my hips is 50 something my hips is 50 something 50 53 then my stomach here my stomach was um my stomach was 40 what hips was 53 the stomach was 40 something then the chest was 40 something also you see 46 no the stomach the chest is 42 the stomach i think is 40 41 40 there i don't know then the hips is 53 you get it's like this but now i don't know if i can stand it's been so long i i've never filmed myself for a while but i can stand so that you guys can see see me i don't know are you guys able to see okay this is me this is me literally this is me okay so this is me let me flip the camera like this so you are able to see yeah this is me are we able to see are we able to see like for real so i want to i'm putting on this spot so it is hard to see but are you seeing yeah this is what i want to deal with this one this one are you seeing and now the tummy let me show you the tummy I don't know you see yeah this one so big i look like a pregnant woman so big okay yeah are you seeing the turn yeah so i'm going to deal with that the funny thing is that the food that that i eat keep on going to my tummy and now it's my time that is coming and it's growing so my friends have also bought me things that will really help me in this journey um i have clothes already for the gym i have my plan i have um like i usually have the support that i need so i'll keep you guys posted uh from tomorrow i, I hope we are going to start seeing my videos going to the gym and then the kind of meals i'm going to eat so if you are there you are really struggling with your body or something you think there's something you can do please we can do it the resolution is to only lose 4 kg per month we're in february imagine 4 kgs up to december how many kgs are those 10 times 4 40 i'll be 50 kgs and probably always will start saying oh what happened oh at 50 is below average i want to be at 60 yeah so hard please pray for me this was really emotional i didn't know i would one day come to the public and start um talking about this but guys please let's do this okay let's do this i hope it is going to work thank you so much and let's keep going my weight loss series episode one how i gained the weight 
Bye, guys.